What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We're giving away two Wax Party promo spots away with this Jaspies High Roller Mystery Crate Numero Uno. And again, guys, this one is the best odds to win a Wax Party pro a party invite. Although it is a little pricey, you're going to have an opportunity of getting some very, very big hits. As you can see, the ceiling is 2800 plus. Now, I was going to take photos of this stuff, but this thing sold out so fast, I mean, I don't even have to show you guys anything. You guys are going to be very uh, very excited, though. This is some nice stuff in here. Now, the worst hit is between four to 500 So, obviously, just like a normal box when you buy something, not there's no guarantees that you win anything back in value. But at least with us, we're letting you know what you're going to get possibly at the high, at the low. And more often than not, guys, I've seen plenty of boxes that people buy for $1,000 and don't get back more than $100, $200. So, uh, getting back four or 500 in value is definitely good. It doesn't mean the card can be potentially graded. Can go up in value, of course, during the regular season, if during the off season, or maybe there are players in the slump. Who knows? Picks it up and can definitely go up. Now again, this format is ten spots, guys. So there's ten hits. What we're gonna do is first open up the crate. You guys are gonna see all the hits. Then at the end, we're gonna randomize the ten names and the hits, and whatever you match up with is what you get. That simple. Now this crate is all five cards, but it does sometimes include boxes, packs, break credit, graded cards, etc. So. This one's just all cards, though, but just to tell you guys there. So here we go, guys. Um, again, here's the dice roll. Here's the customer name. So from John down to Hilton, bought in straight up. And then John won from Ben Mega 12 and 13. So congrats there, buddy. Paying a fraction of the price to get some nice hits. All right, well, let's do the crate. So I don't know if you guys have seen our crate before. We used to have locks on it, but we ended up, like, kind of losing them per se and then one time we lost the keys and then we had to kind of break the lock so now we just don't really use the locks at all but obviously a nice little custom crate that nick got us there a few years back and uh we like to call the crate more being higher end stuff so you know get some nice stuff now again guys there are 10 cards in here and uh here we go All right, the first one is a very, very nice one. This guy finally got paid by the team he's been on since he was a rookie. Very, very solid quarterback in the NFL. This is an immaculate autograph of Lamar Jackson. Four out of 25. Very nice on card. It's a shadow box from 2019 immaculate. So like his second year autograph right there. And there you go. Very nice lamb jack there. Next one. This guy's had the craziest, one of the craziest Premier League seasons, like, ever, honestly. This guy is just scoring goals like there's no tomorrow. And has a chance to win the Champions League, I think, soon, right? In a few weeks. This is a rookie, technically, from 2019 Topps Chrome UCL. It is a Speckle Refractor, graded a PSA 9, and it's Erlen Halan. That is a PSA 9, like I said, Speckle Refractor, and that is a beauty and one to definitely hold on to. Beautiful stuff here. I pulled the True Red uh, during the during that year in 2019. I ended up selling for like 150 or 160,000 as a PSA 10, which is wild. So this guy is definitely, definitely a good one to hold on to. Next one. Probably one of the most iconic cards. Now, his actual rookie card is probably more iconic, but this one is probably second, right? From 1986 Fleer. It is a PSA 5, but still sells pretty well. It is a Jordan sticker. Michael Jordan rookie sticker. There you go. 86 Fleer. Very, very nice card right there. Alright, we're going to start getting to some of the bigger stuff here, guys. Some of the bigger stuff. Now, this one is one of the nicest cards, man. And this one's raw. Definitely can grade it. I don't know how it's going to grade because it is a die cut. But it is a rookie. Bowman's Best from 97. Kobe Bryant. Look how, wait, look at, look at how that pops. Doesn't it look so beautiful? So sick right there. Like I said, I don't know how it would grade, but I'm sure graded probably increases the value. But beautiful, beautiful Kobe rookie right there. And there's a facsimile of his autograph right there. Sick card right there, man. Alright. 
Next one. This guy was the number two overall pick a few years a few years ago now. Uh, this is a contenders. 75th anniversary ticket. Graded a 9-5-10. And it's Jalen Green. Number graded a 9-5 and a 10 auto. Now, this card is not numbered, but it is a 75th anniversary. It's kind of hard to see it, but you kind of look close. They can't really zoom it in too much. There's little 75s all over the background. So they call it the NBA 75th anniversary ticket. So a little bit of a variation there. But a very, very good player right there for the Rockets. A young team still. Hopefully they definitely get better. So that's a nice one right there. And I think we're halfway through. Halfway through, guys. Next card, obviously, is a raw card, but it is number to eight. It is from Donruss Optic. Obviously one of the best players in the MLB. And it's a Shohei Otani. And that is a Elite Series autograph. And it is numbered six out of eight. From 2022 Donruss Optic. And again, not a bad one to potentially maybe grade or something like that if it's gradable. But it is pretty nice just to keep as is in a beautiful little popping card right there. Alright, let's continue on. Next one, another very nice card. This one's also raw. It's one of my favorite uh, type of uh, variations, Cracked Ice. This one is a veteran ticket, Cracked Ice, number to 25. And it's Luka Doncic, on card, veteran ticket from Contenders Basketball. And that is a beauty. And that's 2 out of 25. Alrighty, guys. So that was one of the first ones that were over 1,000 right there. At 1,000, I should say. So those are one of the bigger ones there. This one's also a very nice one, too, as well. This is from 2014. Finest. This is a PSA 10 Super Fractor. Of Drew Brees. And again, guys, this guy's stuff is also very, very uh, under undervalued. But he'll soon be in the Hall of Fame. And I think it should get a little bump. This guy's one of the best quarterbacks in NFL history. But just doesn't get enough love. But that's a finest Super Factor 101 PSA 10 of Drew Brees. And a very, very nice one. Alright, a couple more, guys. A couple more. Next one we have... This one also, too, is not graded, so definitely potential to definitely get some more value back. This guy's obviously back in the MLB after a little little suspension. Hopefully, learned his lesson. Hopefully, he doesn't take any more of, a, you know, ringworm cream. <laughs> but this is a nice card and definitely gradable. And if it comes back a good grade, it could be a really nice one. This is a Fernando Tatis Jr. Bowman Chrome first. Which is 70 out of 99. And then, like I said, to be honest, guys, this card looks pretty clean for the most part. Obviously, I'm sure there's stuff that I can't see under a microscope, but... Or with a microscope, but very, very nice one there. And that is a beauty of a card as well. And remember, he's just signed a much bigger autograph. Not like that anymore. So that's a nice one. And here we go, guys. This is the top card. This is the top chaser. Nick just said one recently. Not even too long ago, maybe... I don't know when he said it, but just recently, one sold for $2,800. This is a very, very low pop. You know, one of, the, one of the better quarterbacks from the 2020 draft class. This is a 2020 Panini Contenders Optic Autograph PSA 10 of Justin Herbert. And again, it's on card, beautiful PSA 10. And like I said, one recently sold for $2,800. So a good one to hold on to. Those, those rookie tickets, man, whether it's contenders or optic, they definitely love to hold their value. So that is a very, very nice one. So there you go. That was the crate. So got the Herbie, the Tatis, the Super Fractor, the Luka, the Shohei Otani at an 8. We got the Jalen Green. Um, Kobe Bryant. Uh, Jordan sticker. We got the Erlen Halan. And we got the Lamar Jackson. I mean, Joey B ain't no Jalen Hurts, though. You know? But, you know, it's all good. They're all great quarterbacks. Alright, so now I'm going to switch teams, guys. And then I'm going to type in the names. And then 
We'll, uh, or not type in the names, but type in the hits, and then we'll randomize a list of names and hits, and then we'll see who gets what. Oh, I need some clear eyes or something, man. My eyes are... True. Both lost the Super Bowl. You know. Both won a national championship. One of them won a Heisman, I guess. The other one didn't, but he was close. But they're both great. But give me Jalen. Give me Jalen all day. All right. I will be honest, I wouldn't have said that last year before the season, but after this past season, I'm all in on Jalen Hurts. Lamar Jackson. <laughs> he does look like him. And that's out of 25. What the hell's going on here? Missed the Sterling. No, you did not, buddy. Um, that uh, is coming up next, man.
Um, the only reason it was $35, Noah, is because we gave away a $1,000 spot here. So, obviously the Mega is not worth $1,000, but the spot in this break was worth $1,000. So, we put in the price of a Mega and a $1,000 spot, put it in there, divided it by 30 and that's why we charge $35. Because the Mega Box wasn't really the reason why people were buying in. They were buying in to win this spot for only $35. Um, if I take out the Herbert, I probably, I really love that Kobe. I mean, I just think Slab Dub would look pretty sweet, but, but yeah, I mean, I, I'd probably go with the Kobe just, just because I love it or the Erlen Halan. I mean, Tatis is great. I mean, that's probably one of the higher values, but just the card in general, like I would probably go with the Kobe or the Erlen Halan. I mean, I love the Luca Cracked Eyes too, but. Yeah, no, the, yeah. Uh, in the title, it usually tells you what we're doing with it. So, yeah, sometimes people think, oh man, they're charging so outrageously priced for a Mega Box. They're scammers, but it's like, no, bro. That's just a filler box. That's all it is. We're just getting a small box. Doesn't cost too much. Do a break, because you can still get something nice out of the break. But then, the real reason why you're buying it is to win a spot into a bigger break. That's all. Alrighty, guys. So here we go then. So again, uh, Lamar Jackson. We got the Justin Herbert, Fernando Tatis, Breeze, the Doncic, Shohei Otani, Jalen Green, the Kobe, the Jordan, the Holland, and uh, the Lamar Jackson. Alright, guys. Here we go. So again, we're going to click the dice roll. Boom. Just snake eyes two times. All right. Well, it's not going to be a crazy randomizer then. One. Two. Boom. Hilton. Dana John. All right. Now, two times. Two times. One. Two. Boom. Two. Tatis at the top down to Earl and Holland at the bottom. And let's see how this worked out here, guys. Here we go, guys. So, Hilton, you just got the Fernando Tatis Jr. Nice. That was one of the top hits there. Joshua with the Drew Brees as well. Nice. That was also one of the top hits. Jay, uh, Jalen Green contender is going to Brian. That was also a nice hit. That was a little under the spot price, but a very nice one there as well. And then, John, hey, this was your spot you won in the Mega number 12. Fleer Sticker Jordan, a very nice hit as well. Nathan, congratulations, buddy. You just got the biggest hit out of the whole mystery crate. That's a $2,800 Justin Herbert, man. Congratulations. Hilton walking away with the Shohei Otani. Very nice out of eight. John getting the immaculate autograph of Lamar Jackson. Joshua, very nice. Also getting the Luca. That is also a top hit as well. Uh, cracked dice out of 25. And walking away with the Kobe as well. Very nice, buddy. That's the die cut refractor there for you. And then, John, again, with your mega box there, you got the Erlen Halan, uh, Top Scrum UCL, Rookie Speckle, PSA 9. So, again, guys, I appreciate it. Again, this was very fun. I Hopefully, you guys liked it. I know it's a little pricey, but, um, you know, some nice stuff there. Uh, it also has two Wax Party promo spots. We still have to do that. But, again, I'm going to talk to Nick. See, we can probably post up another one, maybe similar, a little cheaper, maybe. Who knows? Uh, but definitely uh, would love to do another one of these. Now, here's the dice roll. Here's the customer names. We're going to randomize the customer names now, too, and the top two names win a spot in the wax party. And that's a four and a one five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Wow. Look at that, John. Man. Four and a one five times. You got both. One from your mega box and one from your straight up spot. <laughs> Congratulations, man. That's crazy. Four and a one five times. Oh. So now you're invited to the party, man. There you go. So you got both of those spots from the mystery crate. Random hit. Appreciate it, folks. Again, love to do another one of these hopefully tomorrow. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com, guys. Thank you.